しょう Hello! Do you have any issues with your business right now? That's okay. It's perfectly fine. It happens to the best of us. Honestly, everybody hits these little dips within our growth process. But do you know what? That's exactly why I'm here. I'm here to help you out through it. The only thing you need to do is just take a little bit of initiative by pressing the button in the link of the Cards and Coaching Session Consultation. I'll be happy to help you out and get you on the right track wherever you need to be. It's free. Once you do this, you'll be fully complete and you'll be able to sit back, kick your feet up, and just know that everything's working for you and you don't have to work as hard. Smarter, not harder, dear. March 20th and I am super purpled up today. Can you tell? Because today is purple day. The best color of the day. So purple comes in so many shades and so many different things and purple is such a bold color in general. Um, you know, I truly thought that purple was a really girly color until I was about 14 or 15 and I dated this person that loved purple and I was like, well, that's weird for a guy. But um, now I think about it, it's really not because purple is a really magical color, truly. My favorite shade of purple, personally, is um, plum. I love that deep, dark purple. This isn't even dark enough for me, honestly. And I do love lavender as well, I got that on me. Lavender is one of my absolute most favorite purples. So, what? is your favorite shade of purple let me know in the comments and also let me know um let me know if you end up wearing something purple today maybe you can wear something and just celebrate it that way. so i hope you have a wonderful day i truly do <laughs> and if there's anything that i can do for you or if you have any questions on how you can celebrate these holidays, please let me know. Um, Positively Kimberly's number is in the comments or is in the description. So please feel free to reach out to us if you um, are in need of any hand or positivity boost or if you really just want to chat about purple. Anything works. Happy holidays. Oh yeah, this is time for our awesome affirmation. This is a part of the show where we get to reclaim our awesomeness in the entire world and the universe likes to reward awesome with awesome. Mm-hmm. You'll see the best results in 30 days. Make sure you check out that YouTube channel. But for right now, you can repeat after me if you want, but if not, I really don't care. It's not a big deal. Uh, words will still soak into your subconscious and go where they need to go. So, I am awesome. <laughs> I am the awesomest person alive. I'm having an awesome day. I am the creator of awesome things. I am awesomely fulfilled. It's true. I am totally open to awesome coming my way every day. I am wonderful, <laughs> beautiful, <laughs> talented, strong, girl, and awesome. Everybody has a natural flow to life. Everybody's heartbeat's different. Everybody's rhythm that they walk in is 
little bit different. So a couple of days ago, I was driving the mall, and I heard when was the last time? Beautiful. And I thought to myself, you know, I think it's been. my path to my heart lead me. So I drew it out. Learned some neat tricks recently. So I took my path because time flows through your heart chakra. I took that and I threw it in front of me. And lo and behold, I could see on the highway the directions where I needed to go. I was like, okay, this is interesting. I haven't done this before. I've, I've thrown magic around, but I don't think I've ever thrown my path around to where I could physically see it, which is very, very interesting. I ended up driving around in some of the most beautiful scenery I have ever seen for over two hours. Granted, I was at my destination whenever I started and I just started driving around. I drove an hour out of where I needed to go, and then I drove an hour back, I guess. That's how it ended up. Two hours, whatever. But I had an amazing time. I was just literally following my heart and going with the flow, whatever the flow felt in my heart. Um, and I had so many epiphanies on that trip. Every single time I would start thinking, overthinking something, I'd look up at the sky and it'd be full of clouds, full of clouds, like so many clouds you couldn't even see the sky. Except for you could see a couple rays of the sun trying to shine through. Just tell me, I'm not meant to know everything. I'm not meant to see exactly what I'm asking exactly what I'm thinking about at that time. That's not something I need to waste my energy on. That's not something I need to waste my thoughts on. Because that's not meant for me to know. Other times, I would think about different parts of my path. What exactly I would want, what exactly I would do. Because as I've been driving around, I've been grounding. Um, one of my gifts, one of the natural gifts I do have is grounding. Um, so much so, whenever I was, I thought I really needed help grounding, but it turns out in the spiritual world, I was actually going through the ground, um, at least up to my ankles, and I wasn't letting, allowing myself to move forward easily, because my feet were in the ground. Obviously, if you, if you've, um, waded through water, it's really heavy to walk through water a little bit heavier because it doesn't move like water does. So think about that. Um, I wasn't allowing myself to move forward. And recently I've realized how powerful my grounding actually is. So I've been grounding areas. I've been grounding states. I've been grounding highways. I've been grounding buildings, which is amazing. So I drove around, grounding different areas I touched, and I believe you'll be hearing quite a bit more of Alabama here in the next two to three years. It's getting rid of a lot of shit. Hope you know Alabama's past. super scary, but there are things that only you, and I mean only you, can do the way you do it. 
And that's exactly what the world needs right now. That's exactly what we need. Don't be scared to follow your heart. It's just trying to show you the way. It knows more than your brain does. Follow it. Follow your truth. Follow your aligned path. You can't go wrong. The card of the day. Ooh, perspective. I love it. So, perspective. If we were to reach out or go out into the middle of the galaxy, in the middle of the Milky Way, and look at it all, look at the world, look at Earth, what do you think we'd see? It's all so small. Everything is so small. That situation that you're going through right now, Take a step back, get a higher perspective, and I guarantee you, you'll discover that it's quite smaller than you could have ever imagined. Take a step back and realize that it all looks good from whatever angle you're taking it back from. Things may not seem so small whenever you're up close to them, whenever you're close to a situation. But whenever you take a step back, you notice, hey, that's not all that bad. None of this is going to matter in five years. So take that higher perspective today, I urge you. You never know what you may discover. Hey, Ruth!